Denise O'Sullivan, you are the Sky Ireland Player of the Match. Congratulations. We'll get to your goal and to the football in a moment, but that first half, how, how difficult was that? Yeah, it was It was really difficult. Um, once that torrential rain came, you know, it was kind of unplayable, but um, we knew we, we might have to come back out again, so we went in and we, we stayed focused and um, we came out and we, we, we went to the very end, so I'm glad we're coming away with the three points. Did you think it got to a stage that it was so bad that like this game is not going to be completed? Yeah, during it, when it was getting stuck under my feet, yeah, we were just playing the monsoon and puddles. But um, yeah, I think we just had to get through it at, at that point. It was just mentality. And as I said, we went in and um, we knew it probably would be played tonight. So that was the main thing and that was in the back of our mind. In terms of the second half, obviously Ireland had the far greater amount of chances. You took the goal very well at the end. Did you always feel that goal was going to come? Yeah, I had a few chances before it. Um, so yeah, I was hoping that the goal would come and yeah, it was a great um, ball by Kara Carusa. Um, but other than that, I think the, the players that came into the game, I think Izzy, Heather, Jamie Finn, they all made massive impacts in the game and um, we got told just to put the balls in the box and, and that's what we done. And we, put the pr- we kept the pressure on and we ended up getting the goal in the end, so we're happy. As it stands, the other game is still scoreless, so the Republic of Ireland could be promoted tonight. But how was it to continue that uh, winning momentum and bring it into this game and make it four out of four. Yeah, it's absolutely huge to get three points tonight. That's what we came here to do. And um, look, we have another camp. It's a quick turnaround now, so we're going to stay fully focused. And um, regardless if we get promoted or not, that's not going to be in our heads. We're just going to go into the next games and, and give it 100% and keep coming out with the points. Eileen, obviously a win in the end, but uh, those conditions in the first half, really, really tough. Yeah, it was absolute chaos. I mean, you couldn't run, you couldn't dribble, you couldn't pass. And it was really tough for both teams and for the game of football. But somehow we managed to make a return for the second half and thankfully got the three points. But, you know, it was a tough night. Um, but credit to the girls, they grounded out and came, we came away with three points. Did you feel the players should have been taken off before half time? Yeah, I mean, during that first half, I did think it wasn't was a safe conditions for for players. You know, it could have easily had a, had an injury on either side, and it was really difficult. Um, but as I said, somehow they managed to sweep the pitch, and it was okay in the second half, and we got the job done. And was there concerns from the players at halftime about the game continuing in terms of the safety aspect? Yeah, we, we, we just concerned that the pitch wouldn't be playable that we wouldn't be able to move the ball so that was the main concern so but as I said and as you've seen we went back out and we got the game finished I suppose it's almost impossible to analyse the first half in terms of football but in terms of the second half performance and obviously a lot of chances were created by your team and the goal finally came yeah I mean we wouldn't put it down as a good performance Um, we put it down as you know great on to go until the end and you know get the three points but you know overall nobody here thinks it was a good performance or would even pretend to think so it was a chaotic night between the weather and the pitch and then the delay and then back out so it is credit to the girls that they were able to adapt to that and then we still come away with three points and as you say I presume you would take encouragement from the fact that when the players weren't at their best for whatever reasons that they're still travelling home with three more points yeah I mean ultimately that's what we wanted to come away with tonight and that's what we're coming away with aspects of the performance we can work on and reinforce and but we still needed to come away with three points and that's what we've done well played tonight thank you very much